My name's Malin and today I'm talking about be yourself. It's a very a cliche kind of quote and it seems very simple and obvious, you know, like, oh, well, just be yourself, just be yourself, whatever. But so often we find ourselves playing parts, lying, avoiding conversations, hiding from things and that sort of thing because it's easier. And, you know, at times we definitely should pick our battles. Like, I ran a person that's seen your street, you don't want to be like telling them your your darkest thoughts and telling them honestly how, what you think and what you're thinking at the moment because that's just kind of weird. But if we have to hide ourselves, if we have to play a part for our friends, then maybe we should rethink about are they really our friends? Because at the end of the day, friends are people that we should be open and honest with. And if they are open and willing to accept you as you are, then maybe they're not the people that you should be spending your life with. And I mean, this is just what I think, and you, you're you open to think whatever you want. But for me, you know, what I want is to be a healthy man, to be a healthy masculine man, to be a good father figure, a good role model, a good, a good man, basically is what I'm trying to say, you know. And you can choose whatever you want and base your desires on what that, what you want. And... You know, just for me, with being a man, what that means for me is striving for something. It means working on something and giving value to others and being someone that people can rely on, that people can look to, to help them. And, you know, I think that's what a man should be, because when you look in the past, all the best men, all the men that I look up to, you know, none of them were kind of perfect, but a lot of them, they followed what they believed in, they stick to what they believed in, and they fought for those things. And I think that's a very beautiful thing, you know, especially in our society where so many people are just following whatever they want or just following the herd to try and fit in and play a part, you know. And rather than finding people that they actually connect with, you know, they'd rather just, just fit in and just get along, you know. And so life may not be perfect in this sort of things, but if we don't have standards for ourselves, if we don't have things to strive for, if we don't hold ourselves up to to things rather than letting things just go and say, oh, this is good enough, you know, and kind of settling, you know, then it's not a very nice way to live because then, you know, we're having hidden resentments in the back of our mind and even though we're with people, we can still feel very alone. And... Even when we have conflict with other people, you know, being ourselves, we will have conflict with other people. And I actually think that's a good thing, especially if you're open to perspective and gaining different views. Because sometimes we can get too rigid in our thoughts and we need to be shaken a little bit to see, oh, maybe I can see things from this person's view. Maybe I can see things in a different way. And maybe it changes my beliefs, maybe it reinforces my beliefs, but I've been open to these kind of things. And, you know, for me, I always tried to fit a mold. I always tried to be acceptable to other people and to society. And this led me to be liked by a lot of people, but loved by no one. And that's a very sad thing because if you aren't yourself, if you aren't creating a discrepancy between what you believe and what other people believe and saying, this is who I am, then how can other people connect and identify with you if you're just changing with the winds and following with whatever other people say. And, you know, we have to give, give fewer fucks about these things and choose what we actually want to give a fuck about because, you know, if we try and follow all of these likes and all these things and just play parts and that kind of thing, then we're not really being ourselves. We're not being, we're just being robots. We're just following the herd and following along. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.